I have to ask my last question. It goes back to the Norman Lear thing. Our audience is going to be mad if I don't. Do you think Norman, did Norman take some of those ideas, particularly from Eric Monty? Of course he did. Yeah. You think that brother is just making that up? And the late uh, Michael Evans, if they played the first Michael under Jefferson's, he beat him out of good times. Did it like, did you find out about these things while you were working with him that he was, you know, moving a certain way? I never worked with Norman. Oh, that's right. He was teamed up with Bud York and who was executive yeah, they have director. Broke up. Phantom Productions. Norman came around a few times. I liked his first wife, Frances, who's deceased now. She was very honest. She said Norman should be ashamed of himself. He's wow. cut everybody out of everything and make people think he was he was the only one doing anything. And he he had about as much to do with Sanford and Son as my grandmother, who just who who transitioned in 1969. Other than the fact that because when he parted ways with uh, Yorkin, we never saw him again. And then Jerry Parencio took the helm. Jerry Parencio was the guy that went to Jack Kent Cook and got a few million dollars to promote the first Ali Frazier fight at the Mad at Madison Square Garden. Jerry Parencio owned or still owns Telemundo. And then Alan Horn took the helm. Alan Horn became the CEO of Metro Goldwyn Mayer Studio. These were heavy hitters. These were guys that I went in there and said, hey, and you don't pay me, I ain't coming back here. And they said, we'll see about that with your little cocky self. That's when I went to Vegas. You always got to have a plan B, brother. Mm. Always. My father said it's a poor rat that only got one hole to crawl in. You know, it'd be great to learn more about the, I don't want, you got me thinking, I shouldn't call it Hollywood no more. Learn more about the business, learn more about business and life. That's what I'm about. Show business. It's a business. For me, that's what it was, a business. I never went to the parties. I didn't belong there. I didn't belong there. I was I was not part of that group. I wasn't a bend over Billy. <laughs>